This your boy String Bang. Uh, if you've not subscribed, please consider doing so. Hit that notification bell to be notified of my uploads. As far as my live streaming, if you'll click in the on the link below in the description box, that's my main account, Mountain Bushcrafters Alliance. We do virtual bar live music and chat and panels. Yeah, have a blast over there on Sundays at 6 p.m. Eastern. Mm -hmm. Anywho, the early 2000s, I had a set of Mapex acoustic drums. Neighbors hated me. Rightly so. Uh, and then a few years after that, about 12 years ago, I guess, I had a set of rubber pad rolling electric drums. And I really wasn't satisfied with them. Really didn't take an interest in them. But I've had the Alesis Nitro custom mesh for one month. A little over a month. And uh, we're going to do an update video on that set. What's coming? What's new? What's going to change? The expansion kit that's coming. See if I've grown any in my learning. Watching you drummers. Picking up tips and tricks. Or if I'm at a stalemate. I'm by no means a professional. Don't intend to be a professional. Uh, but if I can play this enough to satisfy me, I'm good to go. Nevertheless, stick around, stay with me, and let's see what we've got right here. One month update review. <laughs> Now, I've had people say, and I've heard them say it uh, on YouTube, oh, that's not a real drum set. I can do, if I was as advanced as I should be, or if I practice as I ought to, I can do anything with this drum set that you can do with an acoustic set. Actually, a little better, because you can fine-tune each individual pad or symbol uh, to define the music. Uh, if you live in an apartment, uh, a duplex, condo, uh, you're sharing an apartment, uh, you don't want to drive your significant other crazy in the house, this is the ticket. I can go max volume, either through headphones or through an eye rig into my phone. Play along with anything or any type of music that I download from another device, whether it be a laptop, another phone. I can use an eye rig and do all my videos right directly through my phone. But I want to give you a little sound bite of what these what my neighbors are hearing. If anything they're hearing. That's what they're hearing. Now I'm going to go directly into my phone from the module. And I'm going to tell you a simplified way to do that. Like I said, it's in the next video. Uh, as we move along. I don't want to run through everything like a mad cat and leave anything off. You got to keep in mind I'm a beginner at a lot of this. So here is a snippet of uh, the sound that you'll be hearing straight through the phone. Now 
Now I'm going to run out of my mono output from the module to an amp. And my advice to you, and from what I've read and what I've seen, the uh, bass amp is the ticket to go if you're going to amplify. Now, if I had an acoustic set, I would, first of all, have to have a soundproof room. Uh, like I said, uh, I'd have the cops up here every day because <laughs> uh, I try to practice every day. And, uh, and that requires a PA system. Uh, that requires a lot more equipment. Uh, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to run into a Marshall acoustic amp. Uh, not the ideal amp to use, but if that's what you've got, that's what you use. I've got the PB Scorpion equipped blaster down there. And my neighbors can probably hear me six miles away. Go into your mono output okay click on your module click on your amp this is what the neighbors are hearing Now that I've demonstrated the various sounds coming from this kit really depends on how I use this kit. It's what I hear, what you hear, or what my neighbors hate to hear. <laughs> from the headphones privately, straight into my phone without the clicking noises, or the raw wide open amplifier. Now, every video that I've shot so far has been raw. Simply through that amplifier with my phone overhead as a recording device. You hear a lot of clicking. A lot of rim shots that you shouldn't hear. But uh, that's about to change with the iRigged 2. And that's in another video. I watched a lot of videos about being able to play along cover songs. And listening to the drums the way they should be heard. I watched a lot of videos. Uh, two were kind of simplified. I want to go a little more in depth. But like I said, that's another video. But as far as this kit, the pros far outweigh the cons. This module's already set up for the expansion kit. Which includes another 8-inch tom and a 10-inch cymbal. Hardware, cables, the whole nine yards. Super simplified, and I'm well satisfied. But don't forget to click on the link below for the Mountain Bushcrafters Alliance YouTube channel. Uh, like I said, we have a live stream every Sunday, 6 p.m. Eastern. Live music, open bar, and chat, and sometimes panel. Sometimes we go two hours, sometimes we go five hours, depending on the mood, depending on the situation. But come over and hang out. A lot of unboxing. Uh, a lot of things going on over there. Uh, but I appreciate the drummers, the folks, my friends, people that stretch out to me with constructive criticism for encouragement and support. There's a big difference in constructive criticism and destructive criticism. I've had this set for a month and two or three days. No drum lessons. I'm learning. It's just going to take time. But appreciate everything that you do for me, everything that you do for my channels, for watching, for helping me along the way. This your boy, String Bean, play on.